So in this video, we are going to uh, discuss and we are going to see actually uh, the welding defects. Okay, so it is also one of the favorite question of surveyor uh, in your uh, oral exams and uh, name the welding defects. Okay, so we'll not be discussing in detail. We'll just look at the name and it's just brief introduction. So first one is the overlap. Okay, so you see here. Uh, that uh, in this groove it was supposed to weld but it is penetrating out okay it is overlapping the same case is here we have undercut we are supposed to weld in this but side we have the this metal was the sideways of the groove there is a undercut okay lack of reinforcement so there is you can see the gap okay because it is not properly reinforced means it is not properly fixed now the, we have lack of penetration you can see here this is the actual metal so here till here only it was able to come so there is no penetration okay so lack of fusion it is not properly fusing inside okay and uh, the, then we have lamellar uh, lamellar trilling lamellar trilling uh, tearing sorry tearing lamellar tearing uh, so here you see it what it is happening there is a crack that is developing band because of this crack resulting pulling out so this whole metal slowly slowly what will happen with this welding piece it will depart from the metal itself okay now we have crater cracks where this crater crack is in the welding itself and then we have inadequate cross section so this you can see this in inadequate cross section underbed uh, cracking so here you see it is it is the underbed cracking that is happening over here gas entrapment so what is basically this is also very important that gas bubbles are getting entrapped inside this small spherical cavities called porosity so this is uh, uh, porosity long cavities called pipes so when we have good amount of air that is uh, long cavities that those are called pipes and then we have small spherical cavities called which is known as porosity we have slag inclusions okay that there is a slag you can see means after all the first pass second pass third pass you are not properly cleaning okay you are not properly removing the fluxes so there is a slag inclusion inclusion between weld passes not cleaned out root not uh, properly back goes so root properly not back goes it has to be thoroughly gazed okay so i hope it is clear for you basically the surveyor will ask you the names of all the welding faults or welding defects thank you so much